first I'd like to introduce Rex Rebo, director of the South Salem MIME Troop. Uh, Rex, um, what is MIME actually? Well, MIME is basically action without words. Panamime and the fact that Panamime is uh, more or less a prisoner of life. It treats life in a realistic manner and tries to produce naturalistic what occurs in life on stage. In mime, we decide on what parts of life we want to keep on stage and what parts we want to delete. And at times, we even exaggerate some of the instances in life so that they are uh, more than real and fantastic at times. Rex, what were some of the difficulties in starting a high school mime troupe? Well, the real problem wasn't mine in itself. It was Mrs. Kornbeck, the uh, drama teacher here at South. Uh, she decided that she wanted to have a mime troupe, and she had worked somewhat in, in the Grotowski classical mime. And so uh, her major problems were getting students who were um, not shy and, and were not afraid of their bodies. And that is a major problem you have in mime, is getting the student to not be afraid of his body anymore and see it as a tool and as, in, as an instrument. It's like drama, too, in the same sense as when you're acting on stage with lines, except here you have to rely so much on the body that if you're not free with it, it you're going to seem awkward and stiff. I noticed that uh, facial expressions were rather important in this. Uh, is it hard to start that, you know, people to show facial expressions of what they're really feeling? Yes, what we work on is a, an exercise in which we go to the complete circle of concentration and circle of... of uh, presence in which we try to touch every bit of the area around us and that involves a face trying to get the face to go as far as it can you know and trying to get a smile as big as you can to frown as big as you can so it will project far is there any I just had 